What's going on guys, welcome back to another mod review and today we are going to be reviewing a mod called the Super Crafting Frame Mod. Now what is the Super Crafting Frame Mod? Essentially guys, what this mod does, it takes an item frame and a crafting table and combines them together to make a awesome new item in the game. Which I think you guys, if you decide to use this mod, you will find it very, very useful. And I think it'd be very good for kind of mod packs or if you're having your own modded kind of series, it would be very, very useful for you. You. So when you install this mod it will add three new items to your game and I have them down here in my hotbar The first new item is the super crafting frame and the other two are the super item frame and the super void frame But let's start off with the super crafting frame Now this is how you craft this item if you are playing in survival You put sticks all around the outside and you put a crafting table in the middle and then you will get a super crafting frame You only get one of them. Um, I've got two in there because I was messing around with the mod before but once you have crafted this item let me show you how it actually works you just need to go to any kind of surface and place it down like you would any kind of normal item frame so let me place it down and then once you place it down you will get met with this kind of GUI screen which is similar to a crafting table screen but it's slightly different let me explain to you what it actually does so what you need to do you need to craft the item that you want to display in this frame so let's do a diamond helmet but if you notice there guys it didn't actually take away any diamonds from the collection of diamonds that I had in my hotbar but that is normal that is what this mod actually does so what we're doing right now we're telling the item frame what we want it to display in the frame so we're doing that and it's saying it's going to display a diamond helmet all we need to do now is hit escape and then the item frame will display the diamond helmet and if you can see the texture is slightly different it's an item frame with a crafting table top in the background so let me show you how it actually works so once we've done that once we've created the super item frame and we've put the item that we want all we need to do now is right click on this item frame and bam it gives me a diamond helmet because that is the item that is within that frame and now keep an eye on my diamonds in my hotbar at the bottom because every time I click on it it basically crafts the item out of the items that I have in my inventory. Now, if I don't have these diamonds in my inventory, so let me throw them out. Let me show you what it says. I do that. It says missing ingredients diamonds. So you need to have the ingredients in your inventory to be able to craft the item using the super crafting item frame. It is really, really useful, guys, and a really nice way to quickly craft stuff. It reminds me of the kind of like the Xbox version. If you have the ingredients in your inventory, you can just craft it by clicking a button. It's very similar to that, and it's very useful. Um, I've kind of set up a little section here to show you guys um, how easy it is to craft stuff. So once you set up all the items frames of the stuff that you want I would recommend using this mod for stuff that you use regularly you know you make if you make a lot of chests have this mod set up so you can just quickly grab your chest now I think I've got all the ingredients I need to make some of these so let's try it out can I make a diamond chest plate yes I can give me a diamond chest plate can I make leggings yes I can boots nice so let's put them on oh they went on straight away can I make a sword brilliant because I had sticks in there so we've got our sword pickaxe yep uh, shovel there we go and as you can see guys the diamonds and stuff are all depleting at the bottom there it's not actually overpowered because it's still using the ingredients that you need can I make a chest yep it took away from my wood there can I make a furnace yep and I can just make as many as I can until my cobblestone runs out there we go let's do the same for the wood let's do that and can I make a uh, I can't remember what it's called a mine cart with a chest in it yes I can I can make that my car with a chest that's what it's called so it's really really useful guys you could just set up a huge wall like this in your house and you could just click craft click craft click craft it's just awesome i really really enjoy it so the other two items that this mod adds guys are the super item frame and the super void frame and how you craft these are like so the super item frame is crafted like this it's got a sticks all around the outside and a dropper in the middle and let me show you what this item actually does so if i place a chest down here and i place the super item frame on the on the front of the chest you've got to hold shift and you place it on the front of the chest like that and let's say i want to put uh iron ingots in that frame so hold shift right click iron ingots will now go in that frame but what this basically does it enables you to quickly put items in and take items out of chest so right now it just put that stack of 64 iron in that chest and so let me show you that again i've got the iron right here and because i've put iron ingots on that chest right click on that it takes the stack out of my inventory it's not there and it puts it in there now so if i right click on it again no left click sorry it will give me 
the contents of that chest. So all I need to do is go up to it, left click, and it will give me the stuff in that chest. So there you go. You see the number is 44. So let's click it four times. One, two, three, four. And it should be 40. There we go. So it's really useful. It's a, it's a nice, quick way to use chests. Let me show you again. Right click. Everything goes in there. Left click. I can just get out as many as I need. So you don't have to go through the hassle of opening and closing chests. So that's a nice, useful one right there. So the next item, guys, is the Super Void Frame. And now essentially what this one is, is basically a trash can. So you can right click with your items and it will um, destroy them. Kind of like an incinerator, but it's just a nice, easy trash can. So how you craft this item is like this with sticks around the outside with an ender pearl in the middle. Um, you place it on any surface right there. So if I want to get rid of these iron ingots right here, just right click and it gets rid of them all. Um, do that one, gets rid of them all like that. I think if you hold shift, I think it is, it will only do one at a time. I oh, know, I think maybe left click is one at a time. So let me do this chest. No, nope, left click destroys the frame. <laughs> so I think it gets rid of the whole stack. So if I get right click now, Oh no, that's doing one at a time, but then it gets rid of the whole stack. It might be a little bit buggy, I'm not actually sure, because if you saw there, it just got rid of one, and then rid of the whole stack. But that's what it does. It basically, like a nice little trash can that you can just get rid of all your items if you don't need them. And there we go. So, that is the mod, guys. A very, very nice mod. I really like it. So, it you can craft stuff quickly, you can remove stuff and put stuff in chests quickly, and then you've got a little trash can as well, so you can get rid of all the extra blocks that you do not need. But guys, um, the link to this mod will be in the description if you want to try it out for yourself. Let me know what you think of the mod in the comments, and yeah guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again in another mod review.